Boilermaker Tailgate Chili Recipe by Mighty Purdue 22 This is the chili recipe the gang eats at Purdue Boilermaker football games. I always prep and cook the chili the night before and then reheat the next day. This is a combination of many different tomato-based chili recipes. Good luck and enjoy! Ingredients 2 pounds ground beef chuck 1 pound bulk Italian sausage 3, 15 ounce, cans chili beans, drained 1, 15 ounce, can chili beans and spicy sauce 2, 28 ounce, cans diced tomatoes with juice 1, 6 ounce, can tomato paste 1 large yellow onion, chopped 3 stalks celery, chopped 1 green bell pepper, seeded and chopped 1 red bell pepper, seeded and chopped 2 green chili peppers, seeded and chopped 1 tablespoon bacon bits 4 cubes beef bouillon 1 half cup beer 1 fourth cup chili powder 1 tablespoon Worcestershire sauce 1 tablespoon minced garlic 1 tablespoon dried oregano 2 teaspoons ground cumin 2 teaspoons hot pepper sauce, e.g. Tabasco, trademark 1 teaspoon dried basil 1 teaspoon salt 1 teaspoon ground black pepper 1 teaspoon cayenne pepper 1 teaspoon paprika 1 teaspoon white sugar 1, 10.5 ounce, bag corn chips such as Fritos, R. 1, 8 ounce, package shredded cheddar cheese. Directions Heat a large stock pot over medium-high heat. Crumble the ground chuck and sausage into the hot pan, and cook until evenly browned. Drain off excess grease. Pour in the chili beans spicy chili beans, diced tomatoes, and tomato paste. Add the onion, celery, green and red bell peppers, chili peppers, bacon bits, bouillon, and beer. Season with chili powder, Worcestershire sauce, garlic, oregano, cumin, hot pepper sauce, basil, salt, pepper, cayenne, paprika, and sugar. Stir to blend, then cover, and simmer over low heat for at least 2 hours, stirring occasionally. After 2 hours, taste and adjust salt, pepper, and chili powder if necessary. The longer the chili simmers, the better it will taste. Remove from heat and serve, or refrigerate, and serve the next day. To serve, ladle into bowls, and top with corn chips and shredded cheddar cheese.